All right, I'm hoping to do a quick video here to show you the um, Home Depot rug. This is the other Home Depot rug that is currently on sale, or well, I shouldn't say on sale, but you can get it at Home Depot for about $15, $16. It's 100% polyester. It really is a nice indoor uh, mat. And to prep it, I take a lint roller and I just go over the surface. And that's to get any, you know, lint, any loose fabric, whatever, any dirt, dust, whatever. And you just, you know, lint roll it and get it ready for the heat press. One of the things I do when I'm doing something, you know, of this size uh, is I lay out the artwork or the images, whatever word you want to call it, just to see how it's going to look, make sure that it's, you know, positioned right and everything else. And what I'll do is I'm going to take the monogram and I'm going to sub that first, okay? The bell just rang, my DK20S16. Okay, boys and girls, just wanted to give you an idea. This is the finished product. Now, this was done at 400 degrees, 60 seconds, and I did it in three separate sections, okay, on a 16 by 20 heat press. So I did the monogram first, then I did the right corner, the left corner, all right, and now it's cooling down, <clears throat> and it doesn't take that long to cool down, and what we're gonna do is we're going to take a lint brush, and a lint roller, I should say, and now roll the image. You're probably asking why am I taking a lint roller? Well, this is a, a trick I learned from, uh, as a matter of fact, from Leanne Clute uh, from another group. She's also a member of our family. And um, when I do wapple towels, uh, I also lint roll them before and after the image is placed because what it does is it lifts up the plush. Now, this mat here has a slight plush to it. So we're going to lint roll the entire image or the entire mat, I should say. And I don't know if you could see it. I can see it here because, of course, it's right in front of me. But the, the, the fiber or, you know, the plush, whatever you call it, is lifting back up. So I'm giving it its, you know, its plushness back again. Ah, it's coming out beautiful. And you go left and right and then up and down. So it lifts up the plush a little bit. And as it cools down even further, it'll lift up even better. But there you go. This is the Home Depot um, doormat. You can find it at most of your Home Depots. You can order it online. Um, and it really is a nice, nice uh, doormat. It's a little bit fancier than the other doormats that everybody's been uh, doing. So this is for my friend Cecile. And uh, hope you like it, buddy.